chapter at the University of Tampa, coming to you live from beautiful Colorado Springs with the 33rd iteration of the Charles R. Walgreen Teak Leadership Academy. I am a graduate of the 30th iteration of the Charles R. Walgreen Teak Leadership Academy, and I'm back here this weekend to serve as a small group facilitator. Um, what that entails is I've got eight guys that I'll be working with to kind of help them through their experiential learning activities and kind of synthesize uh, the activities and classroom sessions uh, and then use that so that they can fully develop their skills as a leader. Uh, one of the things that Teak is known for and synonymous with is Better Men for a Better World and one of the ways we build Better Men for a Better World is through this Leadership Academy, one of the flagship programs of our organization. Uh, we like to focus on the introspective portion uh, and that's what Teak Leadership Academy taught me. Uh, it's not really team building, it's not communicating with groups, it's not uh, leading a group but more along the lines of looking at yourself, knowing thy purpose, knowing thyself, and that helps you become a better leader um, that you don't have to tell anyone that you're a leader. Uh, we've got a lot going on here this weekend. We've got 72 frauders from across North America. They're out here. Um, these guys have really never met each other. Most of them have never seen each other, may not know guys from the East Coast, West Coast, uh, Canada, and all the way down to Texas. Um, what we've got going on behind me here is we've got some icebreakers about to kick off where these guys are going to introduce themselves. They're going to um, learn more about each other and that really helps us set the tone here at Leadership Academy. Um, by these guys getting to know each other better, breaking this ice, um, it's going to help them receive the message that we're trying to get across. Um, we really like to focus um, a lot of energy um, this entire weekend on helping these guys learn the lessons that we're trying to get across to them. Uh, one of the things we do that is through a jam-packed schedule. Uh, we're going to go into dinner here shortly, and then we're going to roll right into ritual, opening night ritual. Uh, we've got a great facility here. It's a beautiful um, place where, we, where ritual occurs, and um, it kind of sets the tone, a somber tone, so that these guys can really uh, appreciate the gravity of the things we're trying to teach them out here this weekend. Uh, it's, a, it's, it's a great experience for these guys. It was a great experience for myself, and that's one of the reasons I've continued to stay involved here with Teak Leadership Academy. I uh, hope you follow along with us. We're going to be going live all, all weekend out here, and uh, we'll keep giving you guys some insight for those of you that have never been to Leadership Academy uh, or those that may be interested in coming to one of the future Leadership Academies. Uh, we welcome everybody to, to apply. Uh, thanks for watching, and have a great day.